Many jurisdictions around the world are considering eliminating the biannual tradition of changing our clock between Standard Time and Daylight Saving Time, or DST. In the fall of 2021, the province of Alberta and Canada held a referendum where it asked its citizens, do you want Alberta to adopt year-round daylight saving time, which is summer hours, eliminating the need to change your clocks twice a year? With 50.2% of voters voting no, the referendum didn't pass. But the results of this referendum can help us understand public preference on how we follow time. Voting in this referendum was tied to province-wide municipal elections, which meant that results on the DST question could be tied to specific communities within the province. We analyzed geospatial trends in community voting patterns and found a significant relationship between where people lived and how they voted in the referendum. Specifically, people in the eastern part of the province were more in favor of permanent daylight savings time, while those to the west were more likely to oppose the resolution. Most of Alberta actually lies geographically within what should be the Pacific time zone, and yet the province follows the mountain time zone, so Albertans already experience DST-like days during the winter. The adoption of permanent DST would have made most communities in Alberta among the most offset from their optimal time zone out of all regions in Canada. This would have created profound social jet lag, which is a mismatch between our social and circadian clocks, and which contributes to poorer health, increased accidents, decreased on-the-job productivity, and poor school performance. The results of this study highlight how geographic location can influence which clock we would like to follow. They can also help guide public education efforts in eliminating the biannual clock change tradition.